What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video on the game Apex Legends Mobile. So in this video today guys, I'm going to give you guys some new news on Apex Legends Mobile, when we're thinking it's going to be released. Recently EA had a conference, which I'm, we're going to talk about as well. And we're also going to be talking about what Apex Legends Mobile actually has in stock for us. A lot of people want to know if it's going to be the exact same as the PC version. So I'm just going to quit rambling and we're just going to get straight into the video. But before I do, make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you hit a like on this video. And comment down below if you're going to be downloading the game as well. Without further ado, let's get into it. Okay guys, so starting off, Apex Legends Mobile. Now, the first topic I'm actually going to start on is the EA Conference. So, on the 30th of July, four days ago, there was a EA Conference where all of the developers at EA, uh, they hopped onto a call and they talked about sort of marketing stuff and basically future games such as FIFA, Apex Legends Mobile, um, and basically just new stuff. So unfortunately, we were waiting on the conference and we were hoping that they were going to give us some more news, maybe a release date or something. Basically, I'm going to give you guys the bulk of their topics. They basically talked about marketing, they talked about new upcoming games, not Apex Legends Mobile, but they did say that all of the developers are basically working from home. So obviously with uh, the COVID-19 and the pandemic uh, going on at the moment, it's going to be very hard for them to, to get out the game I'd say in the short term. So just from news and speculation that I found guys, it's predicted that the game is going to be released January, February or March 2021. So we have only got uh, sort of four to five months to wait. Now, whenever a new mobile game comes out, it comes out on Android devices first. Um, because it's just easier to download an Android game due to all the files and stuff. So basically, the soft release of a game, when a new game comes out, you usually get a soft release on it a couple of months prior. Now, a soft release basically means that they release the game in some countries and you're, you're able to download it and, and try it out, like kind of like a beta. So the predictions are basically going to be for sort of November time. That's when we're going to expect to be able to play Apex Legends Mobile. It's August now, so from now until November, we're probably going to hear some more news. Um, so again, guys, just stay subscribed on this channel and anything I find, I'll keep you guys up to date on. Now next, what is Apex Legends Mobile going to be like compared to the PC version? Now the PC version is great. It's been around, like I said, for two years now. It's got a huge fan base. There's gonna, there's so many players still playing the game to this day. And what we want to know is, if, is it gonna be the exact same as the PC version? Are they gonna add some new uh, sort of characters? Are they gonna add some sort of new guns? We really don't know yet. But I think it would be cool if they sort of added um, something new. Now I did actually find this leaked picture just here, which is supposedly a new map coming to Apex Legends PC. PC and console so maybe when the mobile version releases we'll be able to play this brand new map so yeah I think that's awesome okay now next is the weapons are the weapons going to be a straight copy of Apex Legends Mobile I mean I, th I think they are they're going to be pretty much the same as the PC version you you might find that they might add a few new weapons in the game when the mobile version releases but don't get your hopes up. Again, they may just keep it the exact same. But I'm just trying to figure out and try to get as much news as I can on what exactly it's going to be like. And whenever I get sort of uh, screenshots or anything, guys, you know I'll keep you guys updated if you're subscribed on this channel. Um, next, a lot of you guys have been asking uh, the characters in there. You've got Wraith, Lifeline, Mirage, Gibraltar. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if they maybe added a new character when mobile releases as well. Um, the characters in the game are amazing at the moment. You've got just above me, you've got Bloodhound, you've got Wraith, uh, you've got Lifeline. Uh, my favourite character is Mirage. I think Mirage is awesome. Um, but yeah, I mean, it could happen, guys. We could get some brand new characters uh, when the mobile version releases, which would be, I think, would be amazing. I think the main thing we're looking for, guys, is a game that's going to be able to compete with the likes of COD Mobile and Fortnite Mobile. And I think Apex Legends is definitely up there. It's definitely up there with those big-named A-plus games. 
Um, so I think that um, I think it's going to be absolutely great, and I hope you guys can uh, can can join me on it. So I've already discussed the dates um, that is going to be coming. Um, I'm predicting again, it's going to be around November time. Um, just stay tuned, guys. Again, leading up to November, I will give you updates and regular updates of when it's going to come out. Next, a lot of you guys have been asking what sort of mobile device this is going to be available on. Now, Apex Legends is going to be very intensive game i'm predicting that you're going to need a device with at least three to four gigabytes of ram just to be able to play it so it may be slightly laggy on sort of the older phones and older tablets but the developers are tencent so you know how good tencent are they're probably going to add the, the the lowest fps available the lowest sort of uh, graphic detail available so i think it's i mean you guys have played call of duty mobile that's a really smooth game it's got its bugs and stuff but every mobile game has its bugs um so i believe uh the apex Legends mobile it's going to be quite intensive so if you're thinking about playing it, then I would upgrade to maybe one of the newer phones. Maybe make sure you've got at least three gigabytes of RAM on your device to be able to play it. Uh, a picture just here shows, uh, was leaked actually, and shows some of the devices that are going to be available on it. So check that uh, picture out. And um, yeah, that's, that's just some of the devices. So unfortunately guys, that's basically all the news we've got today. Um, what I'm going to do now is if you guys want to keep up to date with the leaks as they come out, if you guys have got Twitter, I'm actually going to link uh, three different Twitter accounts that um, leak Apex Legends mobile news. Go ahead and follow them. Uh, they're in my description and I'm going to put them in the comments as well. Um, go ahead and follow on them because they, they literally get uh, updates out like the, the, the same day as we ever hear any, any news on Apex Legends mobile. So... Go ahead and follow them. And that's basically going to be the end of the video, guys. Um, before I actually do go, a couple of months back, basically, um, this uh, this guy on YouTube called Legend Studios um, created a sort of copy of Apex Legends using some of the files and in-game stuff. So the rest of this video, I'm going to show you sort of what Apex Legends Mobile may look like. Remember, guys, this is just one guy making this game, and uh, he made a really good copy. So for the rest of this, I'm going to show you what it could look like. Um, but thank you again guys for watching, um, obviously make sure you're subscribed, make sure you hit a like and comment down below um, and let me know if you're going to be playing it with me. Again, I've been Rose Smith, thank you for watching and enjoy this gameplay of what the game might look like. Peace! And here we go! Um, so as you see right here guys, we are flying in on the ship right now, this is all made with Unity. Um, so, it, I mean, it looks pretty cool. All the graphics are great. Uh, we'll just get a bit closer before we jump out. Uh, I think here is, uh, it's about fine. Um, so there we go, guys. We are literally flying in. And this is his sort of development on a bunker. Um, so if we land right here. Uh, there we go. So there we go, guys. I mean, that looks incredible. I think that looks absolutely incredible. Remember, guys, you can crouch, you can jump, you can do everything. Uh, he hasn't added a slide option yet. Um, you can still only crouch on the spot, but this is bunker guys. So I mean look at this again It still needs some more detailing over here I know there's usually some, uh, some little pipes over here where you can get some loot as well as on the other side as well um, So we're just gonna run in and I'm gonna show you what it is. He hasn't added the double doors on here yet uh, But we're gonna run in here and this is bunker guys. So uh, yeah, he, he's gotten rid of some doors. I don't think you can actually interact with the doors that are already in here. Um, but again, guys, this, this just feels super smooth. Um, this is just a glimpse of, again, what it's going to look like. Uh, so let's go down the stairs just here. Let's see what he's added. So yeah, you've got a door here. I don't think you can actually interact with it yet. I've been fiddling around and you can't, uh, which is really unfortunate. Um, but if we walk a bit further over here... Uh, it says here, Bunker is still work in progress beyond this point. Um, so as you can see, that's just you you will fall in just, just into an endless pit if you hop off there. Uh, so we're going to run back, and um, this is basically Bunker, guys. Uh, I, he's, he's definitely going to be working on more stuff. Um, bearing in mind, this is, again, a fan made, so the, the actual Respawn Entertainment um, are going to be working their asses off. I can imagine they've, they've got probably about half the game completed at the moment. Um, we can still do some spawn tests right now. We can, uh, if I just show you, we'll shoot this Bloodhound. He's dead right there. So we've got him down just there, and we can just finish him off, and he turns into a box. You still can't loot these boxes yet, which is a bit unfortunate. Um, but, 
yeah, that's basically uh, what Bunker looks like, guys. So let me know in the comments what you think about that. Um, I just think it's great that this fan is 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 doing this sort of thing. Just to show us what Apex Legends will sort of look like on mobile. It's going to be a lot smoother than this. This is just a test, guys. Um, it's going to be way smoother. It's going to be more detailed. It's going to, The graphics are going to be 10 times better as well. It's going to run at high FPS, so... Don't worry that um, this game, don't think that it's going to come out looking like this. It's not. It's going to look similar to this in certain aspects with sort of the guns and the layout of it and how you've got the wingman in the bottom right and you've got the crouch and the jump. Um, but that's basically it. So if we end the game right now, shows here you are the champion. It goes to the champion screen. I don't think you can move around uh, while you've won the game. Um that is it. I don't know if it shows any more after this. No, I believe it just shows exit to menu and then it takes you straight back to the menu, guys. So that's uh, that's the update we've got on the gameplay today of Apex Legends. So that's basically the end of the video, guys. Uh, again, let me know in the comments what you think about this and uh, how good it looks and let me know your thoughts on the whole thing. Uh, I would appreciate if we can get over 500 likes on the video. That would be absolutely amazing. And make sure you are subscribed and uh, get your post notification bells on to keep up with all of the latest info on Apex Legends Mobile. There's going to be a lot more content on this channel. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video.